Thanks, Anavid. Peer-to-peer payment apps are very popular, even more so during the pandemic, because you can exchange money without ever handling the cash. But this morning, consumer expert Amy Davis has a consumer alert about a payment app scam that could drain your bank account in seconds. Amy? Yeah. Guys, some of the most popular ones are like Zelle, Venmo, the Cash App. So Kayla Lewis uses all of them to collect money from people when she does babysitting or pet sitting services because they're so convenient. And she's never had a problem with any of them until she needed to contact someone with cash cash app about a payment that was sent to the wrong account. It was a Saturday. I was with my kids. I was with my mom. Sakayla Lewis is busy like most of us. So when she couldn't find a phone number for Cash App on the app, she Googled it. Then she dialed the number. She says the man who answered seemed helpful. He was very understanding. He said, you know, we'll take care of this. Just give us a moment. Um, we just need to do a test verification. That test verification, he told her, required her to download this app called Team Viewer so he could, quote, verify her account was legit. He told me where to click on my Cash App. So he wasn't doing anything, but he was telling me where to click. A few seconds into the so-called test, Sakayla started getting notifications of money transfers. I saw notifications for 250 for $9.99, for $2,000, for $500. So I went to my bank account, um, and he was saying, ma'am, you need to stay on Cash App. Please go back to Cash App. Don't leave Cash App. It turns out Team Viewer is an app that lets others control your device remotely. The man on the other end of the line wasn't with Cash App at all. But in less than five minutes, he had nearly depleted Sakela's bank account. I'm screaming, I'm yelling, I'm upset. And he's calm and he's saying, you know, we're, we're going to figure it out. I asked to speak to a manager. She gets on the phone and she does the exact same thing. In all, a loss of nearly $5,800. Sakela closed the app and deleted it from her phone, then called her bank to dispute the transactions. Cash App is aware of this scam and says you should only contact them through its app or website. All right, so Kayla was able to get all of her money back by disputing those transactions with Chase Bank immediately. So these payment apps are very convenient, but they can also be risky if you pay the wrong person or if you need to speak someone direct to directly in customer service because many times you're out of luck. Obviously, these scammers knew that. They set up something online that looks like Cash App customer service. Here's our phone number. Give us a call. Oh, so goodness. we've heard of other people falling for the same thing. Owen, oh, Lisa. And we will share this with everybody. Amy, thank you. This mm -hmm. is very important. 6.15.